I just wish I could have, um, you know, respected women a lot more. Maybe I should have respected them a lot more from not having a mother. But for some reason, it just, um, I don't know, just overdid it. And once you hit the NBA and you got women at, at you know, at your beck and call, you're going to take advantage of it. Well, Taraji, I met Taraji at a, at a HBO party. And, uh, you know, I met her, we hit it off right away. And I've like really, 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 really started liking her. And I just wish I would have done things different. But uh, she was a little older than me. But I learned a lot from her because that was the most significant relationship as a grown up that I had with a black woman. I used to carry a picture on the road with me. Don't nobody know that. Except for dudes that play with me, but she gave me inspiration. You know what I'm saying? A black woman working like that, that's just as good as her craft, that I'm as good as my craft. I remember we were on the road for our, our longest road trip. And we were playing Cleveland. And I, I went off on their ass. But when I'm getting that, one of my inspiration, that's part of the inspiration for me going to, back to see her, going, getting back to LA, was one of the reasons why I like, kicked their ass that day. I remember the, how I was feeling during that game and after that game. And like, just, she inspired me. Things ended with Taraji because of being, me being an immature punk. I didn't know how to tell her that I was falling in love with another woman named Khloe Kardashian. 